Ladies and gentlemen of Jawa, it's your boy Asquad Walker putting together a quick YouTube video to show you one of the one of the PCs I'm trying to sell on your platform. Okay, so let me switch the camera. Over. Oh, this is one of the PCs I'm selling. I suit well. This was the case for my main build, my former main build, but I'm in the process of upgrading. So. What's in here now is an AMD build. So it's a, a Ryzen 5, yeah, Ryzen 5 3600. Um, I think, uh, yeah, yeah, Ryzen 5, uh, yeah, Ryzen 5 3600. You can't go wrong with that processor. That's like a true, I would say like a true budget king. So it's one of the king of budgets AMD. Unless um, you and it's fully upgradable, you could always go to like a 5600, a 5700. But it's a it's an AM4 build, so it's it's like it's like a entry mid range streaming machine. So you'll be able to stream and game at the same time, right? It has a what's that um a six a Radeon 6600. Yeah, it doesn't get hot. See, my the, the problem I used to have when I had my main build in there, I had I have a red. Well, I, I still have it. The, no, 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 no purchases were set in stone. But um, I was going to. I have it on the driver platform. I already got the shipping label. The shipping label for it. But um, one of my. Well, I got two prospects. My client, one of my main clients who I upgrade computers for and stuff, he wants to buy it. He's going to give me 450 for it. Um, but also, my coworker wants to buy it too. And he's potentially going to give me the same price. So, whereas on the Java platform, you know, I understand why. It's not a low ball offer. First off, uh, they was offering me 320 for it. That's pretty fair for a 6950 XT Red Devil. That's pretty fair, but if you know if I can get if I can buy if I can if if you know I have clients who offer who are who are offering me who are offering me more for it, then it makes no sense to sell it for Jawa for less. And also, um, if my client or my coworker buys it, um, I gave them a deal. I like for an extra fifty bucks, I'll get I'll give them a thousand watt power supply. Because for that gargantuan car, you even so, even though AMD says 950 watt minimum, hell no, go with a thousand watt for that car. Yeah, but back to what I was saying. The problem I used to have with well, um, I couldn't keep my glass on because the Red Devil was so big that it would be literally right next to the glass. So the heat from when it's trying to exhaust the heat from the car, it would bounce off the glass and then boom. So I would have to have my case open. Whereas with this 6600, this Radeon 6600, you don't have to do that. You could you could leave it closed. You're not going to do nothing super crazy where you would need to have that ever open. Also, you get a you also you get a PAL P Link five capture card. It's an internal capture card, so it's it can go. It's a 1080p capture card, so it's perfect for Twitch. It's perfect for YouTube. See, I upgraded. I got see over there. I got the Elgato 4K. So when I rebuild my joint with that, with the specs I'm going for now. I'm still Gucci, but I'm hooking y'all up with a Power P Link 5 um, internal capture card. It wasn't, it's not like a cheap, it's not like one of those cheap $80 capture card. I paid a pretty good buck for that P Link 5. It's like, it's like um, a clone of the, eight, um, not the Elgato, it's like um, a clone of the Aver, of the Aver Media, of the Aver 1080p. So, it's, it's a solid card. I, I'm going to put the link on Amazon and everything so you can see what type of card it is. It's a solid card. But, okay. You got a shit ton of upgrade space. So, but you got, I got two, you got a two terabyte and a four terabyte um, mechanical. You got two SSDs in there. You got, yeah, you got two M.2s. You got um, a five soul for the OS, a one terabyte for, you know, gaming space. Um, it's kind of overkill because I got a Ryzen 3600 on a fucking 
360 mm AIL. See, I didn't want to downgrade the AIL because I didn't want to do too much to the case. Yeah, this is a 360 mm AIO with a Ryzen 5 3600. So just think, so just think of the overclocking you can do. You know what I'm saying? Oh, if you want to upgrade to like a 5600 or something, same thing. A 360 mm cooler with a Ryzen 5 3600, OP. You can overclock your ass off and just have a bar. The fans are with the case. You get um um it's it's mainly a thermal take case with three um 140 mm thermal take fans. The controllers are already configured and everything. It's on the other side. My the wire management was a lot neater when I downgraded it from what from the specs that I had because I'm getting a new case too. I'm gonna get like either that new thermal take case where the graphic card goes vertical. Or I'm going to get this Antec case that's like mesh um, in the front and the back. And it'll optimize airflow so I don't have to have my side open like I had to have this side open. Alright. Um, you also get a webcam. You get a... Let me cut the light on. You get a Logitech. I think this is a um, Logitech C925 webcam with... Um, I think there's a built-in speakers or it's kind of big. It's a, it's a quality webcam. I bought this a while back. I never really, I used it probably for one stream and I said fuck it because uh, I wanted to get, I wanted my streams to look a lot more clearer. So I ended up getting a, a Logitech Brio 4K joint and I finally learned how to configure it correctly and I know what type of lighting to use so I can get a real clear stream so this is perfect for someone starting off um actually this is a little bit overkill for someone starting off yeah this is a Logitech C925 it's big because it has really it has a really good mic I think it got dual beam mics that's why it's so big you can pretty much see the mics through the what's his name so yeah you get this with it see i can put all i wanted to originally bundle this with a monitor but i'm like using java and trying to ship this with the monitor is going to cost more and you can get your own i realized i'm like yo you can just get your own monitor no nobody want and it was a good monitor i was including it was an asus um i can't think of the model off the top of my head but it's 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 a hundred and eighty dollar it's it's a hundred and eighty dollar monitor. It gives you a hundred and sixty five hertz, and it has a 0.5 millisecond response time. And the crosshairs on it was really good. But I'm gonna give that monitor. I, I used to call it the Speedy Boy because when I used to rock Fortnite on it, I used to move dumb fast. Even though Fortnite update the update, you move stupid fast now. If I was still rocking on that monitor, I would, I would move re insanely fast. But the Speedy Boy, I'm giving that to my nephew. I'm giving that to one of my nephews so he can have his own dual monitor set up. So I don't have to worry about trying to ship that on Java. I could just ship this by itself. Well, what, well, you get a keyboard. You know what I'm saying? You get a keyboard and mouse. You get the. Um, it's a semi-modular power supply, so it's a 600 watt. So that's more than enough power for this. You get like the extra cables, a um, a gaming keyboard, a gaming. Uh, it's a generic Amazon brand. A gaming keyboard, gaming mouse, mouse pad. You know what I'm saying? So you get that. You get the webcam. Let me put the webcam. I'm trying to speed this up because I'm getting ready to go to the gym. And, um, yeah, it has, like, a little cover. See? Like, you see? Webcam cover. So, you know, privacy. Boom. And keep dust out. So, boom. Yeah. Yeah. God dang it. My bag got a little blooper there. And so, boom. Put this back in here. So, that's what you get with it. I actually was including the speaker system. But, once again, I, it would cost more to ship ship this with all of that and you know chances are you're not gonna want that so i'm giving the speaker the dope speaker system that would have came with this to my nephew too so this i can ship to with jawa in the same box no problem so direct your attention to the screen give y'all the specs real quick what the heck okay um yeah, that's the free antivirus I put on here. Antivirus, you know what I'm saying? You got your 
Got your Discord. Oh, okay. Um, I'm gonna put the specs in the description. So, Ryzen 5 3600, um, 32 gigs of silicon power. Um, no, no, my bad. This is the wrong build. Um, 32 gigs of Team Group T Force ARGB RAM. Hold up. Yeah, that's the RAM. T Force Team Group. I had that RAM for a minute. It, it, it like so when I I personally use this RAM, I use that RAM for like two weeks before I upgrade. That's the funny part. I bought this RAM from Micro Center back in 2019. It was sitting in storage for a year and a half before I moved to where I'm at. So it wasn't really getting no use. And then when I finally put the build together, I'm like, well. I want more RAM and I want a better graphic card. And you know, I, I got a pretty decent job. I already had the Home Depot. So I was like, fuck it. So I ended up upgrading my RAM to something way better. So I, this was just sitting in a build waiting for me to sell it. it was, I had this computer just sitting for like a year. So when I'm on the job where they ask me how long it's been used, like it, technically it wasn't used. It was just sitting here collecting dust. Because nobody wanted to buy it. I live in Newark, New Jersey. So everybody trying to hit you with the scam move here. And I'm like, I'm not trying to hit nobody with the scam move. And eBay. Oh, don't get me. I'm not even going to say nothing bad about eBay. Because I don't. Because this video is going, going on, is going on the Java platform. And hopefully it leads to someone wanting to buy this build. So I'm not going to tell you how I really feel about eBay. But if you want to know how I really feel about eBay. Either hit up my YouTube channel or hit me up on Instagram. At damn, what the hell is my Instagram? Oh yeah, A Walker nine seven three. Uh, that's that's my Instagram. All right, so this is what you get in here. You got your stream tools. You know your Discord, OBS, um, Stream Labs. You know all the stuff you need to get your your stream up and running. Um, got your gaming apps. I, I put some backgrounds. This is you know, one of my favorite One Punch Man, Saitama. And you got the game launcher, Steam. Um, I was gonna put I was gonna put EA, but you can add that yourself if you play Apex. All right, so boom, and these are the and last but not least the tools. Okay, so yeah, you got the motherboard tools. Um, I think I up I upgraded the bio. So if you if you keep this motherboard but change want to change the processor down the line to another AM4 one, it should work no problem because um I up I upgraded the bios. But just in case I didn't, if if I didn't update the bios, double just double check behind me and make sure the bios is up to date before you change the processor. And these are the tools. And this is the tool that controls the fans. TT RGB Plus. Yeah. So let me give you one more look at the specs real quick. Oh yeah, it has a fully activated Windows 11. Wait a second, shit, hold up, um, not that, I want to go down to about, oh, here we go, okay, okay, about, yep, specs, Ryzen 5, 3600, 6 core, well, with the, with a 3, with a 360 mm liquid, <laughs> you could probably get a lot more than that when you, over, if you overclock. 32 gigs of RAM, um, and I think I have adrenaline up here, the AMD program, so you can see the, yeah, I do, okay. All right, oh, shit, I got, okay, I'm going to update the driver real quick while I'm already browsing to the stuff, okay, so, uh, okay, man. Performance, 
right there. Um, right there. RX 6600 and <laughs> it ain't doing shit right now because boom, it's I it's um not even close to low. So I'm a, up. I'm a, um. So this is gonna be from this date, which is February 15th. It's updated from here. So whoever buys it, whenever somebody buys it on Java, and whenever you get it, um, this is what's the latest. It's been updated. All right. So yeah. Um. Webcam, solid stats, internal capture card, a big case with a lot of room and a lot of upgradeability. You can't go wrong. You can't go wrong. I am looking to get. I'm looking to get probably eight hundred for this build, but you know, with the Jawa fees, is nowhere near as bad as eBay. So, whatever. After the sale price, I'm looking to get 800 for this. I think that's a pretty that's the, I think that's a pretty solid deal because it's pretty much a mid range build with a real good case and the extras, the bonuses alone, the the solid the solid internal capture card with the webcam. You can't beat that. You, you can't beat that. 32 gigs of RAM, um, uh, 360 mm AIO. With a fucking rise with a Ryzen 5 3600, so I dare not, I dread not think of the magnificent overclocking performances you can get with that. But yeah, no, um, no, yeah, that's I think that's a pretty solid deal considering I'm gonna have to. I ain't gonna, I, it ain't gonna be too crazy, but um, I'm gonna go with the Java shipping label. Right, but then um, chances are I'm gonna have I'm gonna more than likely have UPS prepare it. So they have they have a service where if you take it to a UPS store, you can pay them to professionally pack it. That's what I'll probably do. That so nothing gets fucked up because I've never shipped a computer off ever. This is my first time shipping a computer off. And um, y'all see, I got the um the the the, the office grade gaming Dell up there that's that one is pretty good that one's behind me over there and i'm gonna have one more build but i'm repurposing it from intel to an amd motherboard and pro um processor so in that build i'm probably gonna have another ryzen 5 i'm probably gonna have another ryzen 5 3600 but it's gonna say same specs um, same specs, it's gonna have 32 gigs of RAM. Um, so I'm gonna have a capture card, but the um, GPU in there is gonna be a 1660 Super. And that build, I'm looking to get like that build, I'm looking to get like mm, probably like 550, 600, uh, 550. It's, 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 it's not, it's, it's, it's very solid stats, but it's rocking with a 1660 Super. And it's like, it's not like. It's not an ancient card. There are better cards out there, but if you're doing mid-range stuff, it's like like it's gonna be a big step up from what's in there now. What's in there now is a i3. What I got in there? A i3 um, 10100F, and the motherboard is a okay motherboard, but it has this one D. It was I bought it used off of eBay, and with most of the 11th gen intel stuff i forgot what that sock i think b450 now though it's hard to get a brand new motherboard with that and you can't buy that motherboard off of, well you can't find a new one like you like a motherboard for like a ice like a i5 anything 11th or 10th gen no not 11th anything yeah okay anything 11th and 10th gen intel Finding a motherboard for that, you're going through the used market, right? You're going, to, you're going through the used market, and the problem with the motherboard I got, it works, but if you over tighten the screw by where the RAM slot sat, it won't read all the sticks of RAM. But it's working now because it's not over tightened. But I don't want to sell that build like that, and then I get, a, I get an issue with, you know, I, I want to try to make a good impression with the Java platform. So I don't want to sell that, and then that happens, and I get an issue, and then you got to ship it all back. I don't even want to put up with that. So I'll get a, it's easy to find new AMD parts. But in this situation, I don't even have to go new. I'll just use the per um 
my the personal motherboard that I have now, which is a B550M Aorus Pro M. So I can just use that motherboard in that case because it's a micro ATX. And then I'll just put a um because I'm more than likely I'm gonna sell the 5950X to probably my client. So I'm gonna sell that that processor to my client, and then I'm gonna get a, another 3600 and put in that motherboard because the BIOS is updated. Because I was you know, it, it had a 5950X, so it had, of course the BIOS was updated. So I'm gonna repurpose that last build with that motherboard and processor. It's still gonna have 32 gigs of RAM, all the bells and whistles, but yeah. So there you go. You got all your specs. I hope. Um, I hope. This uh, it's no limitation, uh, time restriction um, on Java because then I have to edit the fuck out of this. But yeah, so there you go. This just so that build. So what you're getting? Webcam, capture card, solid build. It ain't like no ultra 4K, but pretty much anything 1080p mid to even high, you're Gucci. All right, well, thanks for looking. Peace, ladies and gentlemen of Java. It's your boy Asquire Walker putting together a quick YouTube video to show you one of the one of the PCs I'm trying to sell on your platform. Okay, so let me switch the camera.